I came to Australia in year two from Vietnam. I spoke very little English, totally out of my depth when going to, going to primary school. I had never taken a science class before coming to SAC, so when in the first lesson we were doing like safety and then we looked at a Bunsen burner, I was really freaking out, but I was always welcomed here and I always felt supported here and, and I'm really grateful for that. One thing that's always stood out to me during my time at St Andrews is the focus on using what you're taught and applying it to solve the challenges that you see. There's always an understanding that what you learn has consequence if you're able to apply it to the real world and I think that's something that's really valuable um, about the education that we get here. We really understand what it means to be a, a part of our community and what it means to be able to uh, serve other people. Towards the end of 2019, uh, I went on uh, the St Andrews 20-day hike. Our hike was unfortunately cut short 14 days through because there was a 2,000 hectare bushfire one morning when we woke up and we had to be evacuated back home. And that really made an impact on me because it uh, really put me in touch with the reality of, of the suffering um, that was happening there. At the end of that journey, I had an inkling that I wanted to apply my computer science skills somehow. I did my research, I made a design brief, I made a plan for how to implement it, I went through the plan, uh, and I got a product at the end. So my computer science teacher, Mr. Till, knew this guy, he played baseball with 20 years ago, who turned out to be a superintendent for the RFS. The main problem for the RFS is how to best manage its resources, one of the most essential resources in firefighting is, of course, time. If the RFS are able to be more efficient, that means they're able to save more homes, they're able to save more lives, and they're able to reduce the uh, amount of land that, that is ultimately affected by, by these bushfires. And you'll be able to focus their attention towards things that are more crucial, that are more important. We're a fairly low-income family, and I was really, really fortunate to be able to be granted the scholarship and to be able to be supported financially throughout my entire time here. Um, and it's really an opportunity that I'm immensely grateful for and I hope that I've been able to give back to the school in a way that you know justifies everything they've given to me. Looking to the future, what I'm interested in is um, applying computer systems to solve some of the global challenges we face, like poverty, um, inequality, and the ones that are associated with climate change as well.